Hi, my name is Matthew Pizzi. I'm going to show you how you can apply an image to a transparency inside of Photoshop CS6. There could be several reasons why you want to work with transparency inside of Photoshop. In this particular example, what we want to do is get this image of New York City inside of text. To achieve this effect, we need to make sure we have the Layers panel open. If you don't see the Layers panel, go up to the Window menu, and under the Window menu, you can choose Layers. Once you have your Layers panel open, you want to select your Type tool. T is the keyboard shortcut. With the Type tool selected, you want to go ahead and choose a large sans serif font. In this case, I'm going to go with Arial Black. And I'm going to set it to 72 pixels, the largest size you can set in this menu. We're going to go ahead and transform the size of this text to make it even larger after the fact. What we're going to do right now is click. This will give us a blinking cursor, allowing us to type out New York. Once we type out New York, we want to access the free transform tool so we can increase the size of the type. Command T or Control T is the keyboard shortcut. Once the free transform tools bounding box opens, you want to go ahead and grab one of the corner resize handles. Hold down the shift key to constrain its proportions. Once you have the text size properly, press enter on your keyboard to accept the transformation. The next step is an important one. What you need to do is you need to make sure that your type layer is underneath the image of New York. Now, if New York is the background layer, you're going to have to double click it and rename it layer zero. Then you'll have the ability to drag your type layer underneath the New York picture layer. Once you have your layers stacked properly, simply hold down the option key on the Mac, alt on windows and click in between the two layers. This will effectively create a clipping mask and you'll see the image inside of the type.